Hello, I am Ice Beast, and welcome back to EU4. So we're sitting here in a weird spot. We're currently annexing the Pope. It's going to take a while, but uh, we are getting that done. This will piss off some people, but whatever. I don't give a crap. Um, I was hoping to ally Sweden up here at some point. That's not going to happen um, mainly because they have too many great power allies. We both have too many great power allies, I guess I should say. Um... Savoy is probably going to become our target in the relatively near future. They have a truce that ends with us in seven years, so we'll probably be going after Nice here to sort of complete our our region. We're annexing the Pope so that we can consider becoming Italy. Um, the main problem with Italy is that their ideas kind of suck. Um, they don't suck, they're just... I, I really like the Tuscan ideas. <laughs> Um, I also want these two colonies from Spain, and I really want to start going after Tunisia. Um, so I'm actually going to start fabricating a claim on... Um, how the hell do I do this? There we go. I'm going to start fabricating a claim on um, on Brzite here, which is right next to the capital. I'm actually going to try to isolate Tunis um, pretty quick here. But yeah, I'm going to go to war with Tunisia. They are allied with... The Ottomans and Morocco. Now, the Ottomans are definitely scary. The Ottomans are currently at war with the Mamluks, though. So, if we can possibly get in to a war with Tunisia... Oh, they're allied with Morocco. Is there anybody... Oh, yes. If I could get Morocco in on the into a war somehow, I can um, use it to pull Tunisia in, which would be really good for us. And, of course, France might come in on our war as well, so we'll see about that. I do want to bring these boats home. So I think I'm going to have to send them here first so they don't die and then send them home. And then, of course, so these guys want military access. And we're also building up our colony here on the eastern seaboard. This will soon be all our territory, guys. We are The goal here is to become the eastern seaboard of awesomeness. And by awesomeness, I mean Tunisia. <laughs> Tunisia, Tuscany. Um, gain 10 papal influence or gain 5 prestige. This is one of those few times where I think gaining the 5 prestige is the better thing. Especially because we're almost near 100 papal influence. Um, why are you guys both here? That was weird. Why don't you go to Lombardi? That was weird. I don't know why they were both there. We're also waiting for our manpower to tick up some. That's the other sort of major thing we're working on right now. And I'd also like to build up more boats. Um... Yeah, we, it'd be good to increase our, our boats, so I'm going to do that with uh, some light ships. I think I'm going to build two light ships, add them to our big light ship fleet. But otherwise, yeah, we're doing pretty good, so you guys can sort of see what the plan is here. The only thing I really got to worry about is France pulling me into a war. Um, but otherwise, I think we'll be fine. Where is my, uh, this fleet? You're good. If you guys could just come home. These, these are my stepping stone colonies, I as I would say, to get to these guys. <laughs> so that my colonial, my, my new world colonialism can begin. What is the next best place to get? I think I'm going to go for, uh, either of these. Yeah. Wakama. Or, uh. Um, oh, I forgot I had a loan fucking coming due. Um, let's let's use this opportunity to lower our army maintenance just a bit so I, I can get that money. Totally forgot about that. But yeah, we'll lower our army maintenance for a bit. Hopefully we get up to about 20,000 manpower. Um, let's look at how the Ottomans are doing, by the way. Um, military, armies. Um, they're usually really strong. We'll go by force limit because that will get them right up here on top. So they have 78,000 men. They have a ton of manpower. The Mamluks have no men and no manpower. That's not good for them. France, though, is right here with about the same number of men. Um, so if we can just get the Ottomans not to come in on the war or get France to come in on the war, we'll be fine. Why do I have 4,000 guys here? Did I build 4,000? Oh, because they were supposed to join this army over here. <laughs> this is me totally paying attention to all my stuff. And, I mean, there are just rebels running amok through uh, these guys' land. Nope, you're the wrong boats. There we go. 
Rebels are just running rampant in um, their lands. Where can I send you? I think still going to... Um, hmm. So, what I need to do is let it tick a month. Right now we're collecting 9.37 in Genoa. Now we're collecting 7.7 .7 in Genoa. Wait, what did I just... If I have you now go to Genoa. Um, see the problem is, is I'm losing money by sending them to protect trade there. Yeah, we're losing money right now. It is going to increase our trade value. So that's what we're going to do is we're going to split the fleet in half. I'm going to have you go protect trade in... In Alexandria. No, wait. Would that help me? No, I don't think that would help me. Um, so let's have you protect trade in Genoa and you protect trade in Venice. I think that's actually going to come out more ahead for me. We'll find out when the month ticks here. Got my claim on Tunisia. That actually will really allow me to see... Um, who would come in on the war? The Ottomans would come in on the war. Um, Hungary would not come in, but France would come in. That's really good, actually, for us. Um, is there anybody allies I can get? They hate us. Hungary's our ally. They hate us. They hate us. Lithuania. Maybe I can get you to become my ally. Um... Besides hating us, the great power allies of me and them would never cause that to happen. England, of course, doesn't like us. They're not going to come in. would love to get uh, this ally, but that's not going to happen. Um, can I get like a small power ally like these guys? Like Brandenburg? They have so many... Um... Yeah, these guys would totally ally me. So let's improve relations with these guys. I just want the extra men. Brandenburg is not a bad bad ally to have. Um, I also need to raise up my... Uh, I want to be able to pay off this loan before I go to war. And I'd like to have a decent amount of manpower as well. So the only thing that... The only negative is if the Ottomans win their war with the Mamluks. God, 29,000 Algerian patriots. Venice has been fabricating a claim on Firenze. Venice is somebody else I'd like to go to war with, but their allies are going to prevent that. I'd have to pull them in. Um, the knights. The knights are the... Oh, who, who are you allied with? Just Venice. So if I declared war on the knights, I would just pull in Venice. That's really good, actually. That's something I'm going to consider doing. I'm even doing no CB war. Since I doubt I'll be able to get a CB against them. Okay, let's pay off our loan. We're going to repay our loan. What's this? National Decisions. Pass Blasphemy Act. Oh, I can't afford to pay off my loan. Pass Blasphemy Act. Where is this? Missionary Strength plus one. Tolerance of Heretics minus one. Um, Embrace the Counter-Reformation, Tech costs more, Popal Influence increase, Missionary Strength versus Heretics, and I get two missionaries. Um, let's get... This is a heresy, right? It is a heresy. Minus 8% for provincial tax income, but other... Yeah, I'm never going to be able to convert this. And then... This is, you also have a heresy if I'm correct, right? Would I be able to convert you? Um, four. No, this would be about five. They have a ton of religious zeal. If the religious zeal goes down, I'll be able to convert them. All right, I don't think I'm going to pass the uh, this idea either. I could add a policy. This would give me... Um, Plus 10% trade efficiency, plus 10% national modifiers um, in exchange for, what, one military point a year? That's something really interesting to uh, to think about. 
anyway, um, once this ticks up, I'm going to raise our army maintenance back up. And then we're going to get this... Oh, whoa. Whoa. Did you have to dissolve your alliance? No, but... Come on, take up one, and then I'm going to fabricate a claim on a Naba Baba. -ba -ba. Uh, lose 10, lose money, or lose 5 prestige. Well, there goes that prestige we just got. Let's repay our loan. I was going to go to war with Tunisia, but now I think I'm going to go to war with, uh, with, uh, Kabia here. Instead. Um, yeah. So, once you take up, I'm going to, uh, take you. So it's stop improving relations, and the question is, would you accept an alliance? And the answer is no. Um, 20 plus 10 plus 5. They say that 36 is less because we're not the same religion, and they don't trust us. So I'm going to go back to improving relations with them. Um, we're about to fabricate the... the I'm mean, about to annex the Pope, so I'm just going to wait for that to happen instead. I uh, discovered that place. Cool. Come on. This is going to be done here in a second as well. Oh, we annexed the Pope. Uh, the occupation of rope happened to us. We've gained a uh, reduced 10 per 9 10 yearly papal influence, and everybody's upset with us. We can form Italy if we want. Um, Italy would make us a, a despotic monarchy. Which gives us national unrest and unjustified demands, uh, things. We gain new traditions and ambitions. We're, well, I'm going to not do that yet. I'm going to let people think about it. Um, that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to allow people to consider what's going on there. I'm also going to raise the army maintenance. That's what I want to have the army maintenance up and ready to go for when this war happens. Or when a war happens, I should say. We also gained five dudes. Does that put us over our supply limit? No, it doesn't. What did you have? Four, one? Why aren't you guys on the same location? Um, we lose one stability, and everybody gets mad at us. Or... So everybody's upset with us that I didn't um, give the Pope back. Whatever. Bye-bye. And Austria has entered a military coalition against us. That is a problem. So we're going to improve relations with them. We're going to stop improving relations with these guys. Because um, my diplomatic reputation is that bad. That sucks. I'm going to start uh, fabricating a claim, though, over here. Once I get... God damn it. Click the right goddamn thing. There we go. Anaba. Who did you... You haven't allied with anybody yet. Okay, good. Uh, this colony has become self-sustaining. That's fantastic. It's time to pick... I guess we'll take uh, Wakama. So you get down there to Wakama, my friend. Cool. And then what I want to do... Why, did, why haven't you gotten to this stupid army? All right, cool. And then this, I guess, will be the start of a new army. I can get up another three guys. So what I'm going to do here is actually... Um, I'm going to get just three cannons, I think. Once I have the money to afford them. Wakama. Is this silver? No, it's iron. God damn it game just wants to take all my stability like a bunch of bastards so yeah I'm improving relations with Austria so they'll get out of the uh, war with the or out of the coalition against me France is upset with us because of uh, the independent not giving Rome independence I'll probably improve relations with them soon as well up to 25,000 manpower though which is really good I want to go and get this war started, but but I cannot. Oh, and I've already apparently fully uh, upgraded them. 
Well, that's funny. Let's look at the knights real quick here, see if that, that would work. Declare war on the knights. Uh, I just lose two stability. Venice would come in. Um, and the major, main goal is to... Uh, I mean, I'd love to conquer the knights, but... And I might try to do it. First, I'm going to think I'm going to go to war with, you know, actually attack Venice. Um, unfortunately, my that navy will not be able to survive. Should I do this, guys? I think I'm going to do it. I'm going to let my manpower take up just a little bit more, and then I'm going to do it. It will give me an excuse to go to war with Venice. Um, we can get... Another idea group. Oh, that's really good. How close are we going to be able to do this? We're not good close at all. So we're going to do this. We're going to get another idea group, which is going to be totally military idea of some kind. And the question is, which one do I want? Quantity idea gives me more manpower. Quality idea makes my guys better. Uh, defensive ideas are also pretty good. Uh, plutocratic ideas give me mercenaries. I don't think I want plutocratic ideas. Um... Don't care about naval ideas. Quality ideas. So what I get? I get in better infantry ability, better army morale recovery, better comp really morale of navies. Okay, here I get better manpower, better recovery. Regiments are cheaper. Maintenance is cheaper. Force limits are increased. Land attrition is reduced. I get army tradition. Morale of armies increases. I get... Um, Maneuver, my armies become cheaper, my force become better, my armies reinforce faster. I think I'm going to go with quality ideas. And then I think I'm going to take an idea right away. Let's get that infantry combat ability increased. Beautiful. I'm not disappointed with that at all. Otherwise, I just want to get in position to go to war with these guys. Why do I have one flute? Oh, because they have one flute, of course. I keep forgetting I annexed Rome. Keep forgetting that. Alright, let's get these armies in position. Are you, um... Why do you have so many cannons? I feel like I fucked up maneuvering my armies. Select this unit. Go to Cuneo. You. Split. Cannons. Select this unit. Go to Verona. Okay. Yeah, I think I fucked up, uh, you know, maneuvering my armies. Venice has the Peasants' War. Oh, this is beautiful. That's really good for us, I would say. Where are those 5,000 dudes? I want you to go to Ferrara. Ra, ra, ra. Cool. God, yes, the Peasants' War. That is fantastic. All right, guys, I am going to take the... Uh, oh, I wish I hadn't spent my admin points, though. God damn it. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to wait until I have enough admin points to boost my stability. Then we're going to go into the war. Did they change this interface? Yeah, we're going to wait till we have enough admin points to boost stability, and then we're going to take the war. So I apologize if... Uh, oh, god damn you, Britain. They must have conquered this guy. Oh, I need you to come here. Oops, you're supposed to do that a while ago. And then you can uh, spend one military power to crush the natives. Natives are dead. Beautiful. Who are you at war with? Did you go to war with uh, these guys again? God damn it, France. That means that if I declare war, you're almost certainly not going to... Oh, no, they'd still come in. Only Venice is coming in as well, which is good. 15,000, 16,000 men. I am ready for the war. Can I make an, a, a leader out of my dude? Recruiting an admiral. Make a leader out of my dude. Beautiful. He's a 2-2-2-2. Two, 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 two. Not the worst leader in the world. Alright, guys. So, expect the war to happen on the next episode.
Um, I don't want to fabricate. The, I, I don't want to dissolve the alliance. That was almost a disaster. I do want to improve relations. But yes, we are going to go to war on the next episode. Uh, it's going to be a no CB war. But until then, I thank you very much for watching. On, and uh, I'm excited for this this attack on Venice. With that being said, I will see you all next time.